Dallas Cornell. I've been a musician my whole life and spent about 30 years playing the drums. Played a lot of uh, punk and ska, folk, country, classical music, jazz. Anyway, currently I'm in a band called Boots and Needles and we play a lot of vintage country. Not, not the modern stuff you hear on the radio so much, but real classic stuff. Uh, some Dolly Parton and Porter Wagner, Ernest Tubb, George Jones, that type of older country. And even some folk, folk songs, murder ballads that go way, way back. Anyway, all that said, I've spent most of my time playing drums with brushes in my hand. So when Collision Drumsticks called, I thought, you know, I'm going to take a chance on their brushes. And I was a little concerned because uh, the brushes that I've been playing with them, I've been happy with. But I feel as a good musician, it's, it's good to adjust and good to try new things. So I tried these. First thing I noticed, the br bristles are real pliable, which I thought, uh-oh, it might be a problem. But it wasn't. Uh, I found that I can be a little more articulate with them uh, and, and be a little more nuanced. Some of the stuff that I, I wanted to play quiet is easier with these because it's a lighter br bristle and, like I said, more pliable. Another thing I noticed was uh, the brushes I play with, you try to push the brushes in and out and it's a little sticky. These ones, literally, I've been playing with them for about a month or so, smooth as can be. And, uh, you know, sometimes you need it nice and tight for a sharp sound. Sometimes you need it spread wide for a softer, smoother sound. And I, I do this while I'm playing. I'm, I'm adjusting, sometimes adjusting my snares, sometimes adjusting the spread on the bristles. Anyway, I get, uh, another thing is about these brushes, they don't leave your hands feeling tacky or uh, any residue on your fingers, which is nice because nobody likes being annoyed after working for a while. So uh, let's see, our articulation is great. Uh, they're comfortable in my hands and uh, comfortable when I'm done playing with them. So got a nice song coming up called Thanks A Lot by Ernest Tubb. It's an old country song. And my band with my wife, Boots and Needles, my wife Lauren Asham and my dad, Daryl Cornell, were performing it for you here at uh, Palmer's Bar in Minneapolis, Minnesota. We actually play there once a month, among other places around town. Anyway, it's nice to have a good product to uh, hold the fort down. And I hope you enjoy our rendition here of Thanks A Lot. Mm -hmm. 